Hello everyone, so we already made quite a lot of videos using big different bibliometric softwares and some of you commented on the videos that how to actually install these softwares. Okay, so first of all, these are some of the softwares here. You can see his side, BibExcel, Voss Viewer, Gephi, Bibliometrics and SiteSpace. Some of the softwares we used and also we will be using in the upcoming videos. Okay. And today I'm going to show you how to install each of them. And it's really easy. All of them are freely available. And I will also put the link below in the video description. Okay. So let's start with one by one. So let's start with his site. So with the hit site, it's a bit tricky because it is no more available in Clive Variet's website. So it was developed by Gwyn Garfield. He was the founder and then it was maintained by ISI Web Science for quite some time. But then since like two or three years, they discontinued for the development of the software. But then what we did, we actually downloaded the copy, put it in a GIF file and put it in our website. So you can download it from the Research Hub website. Okay. So here, if you go here on videos, you will see that we have some on one video playlist on bibliometrics. So if you click here, you will see our video playlist here. But if you scroll down, you will see that here, from here, you can download the his side software. Here you can also see how many times it has been downloaded. Okay. So just click here, download and install. And then after installation, if you have any issues, see our videos on this and see our video on how to work with his side. You will see how it works and also Follow the comments in the video description for the his side videos because you may have some problems so you can fix that okay so that's easy so the next one is bbxl so for bbxl we will just go to google and search with bbxl here you will see here is the website for bbxl he is the founder Okay, Ole person from actually Vienna. He's from Vienna. So he here you can see here is the link to download the BibExcel software, and then you will just follow the procedures normal for normal procedure to down, uh, to install any software. So you just follow the normal procedure, and then you will have the software ready. Okay. Then the next one is Voss Viewer. I'll do the same thing for this as well. Just Google for Voss Viewer. And here you can already see the download option here. You can just click here download and then from here based on your requirement You just click the one I have Windows. So I go for Windows one you can download and then just follow the normal Procedures to install the software. Okay the Next one is Gephi Also the same If I just Google for Gephi download all the softwares are free of money free of cost, you know, so it doesn't cost money here you can just download Gephi for Windows or if you have Mac or Linux, you can download from here. Then we have Bibliometrics. So the Bibliometrics package, this comes with the R software. It's a software within the R package. So for this, you first need to know how to install R software if you don't have it. Okay, so you have to install the R software, then R Studio, and then you can install the Bibliometrics package. For this, we actually have a video on our YouTube. So on our YouTube, we have a video on this where we actually show Hello, how to so... install our software. So if I go here, I'll put the link below in the in the video. So here, our studio. So the first video on Hello, this playlist so is how to install our console and our download studio. And so if you just watch this, software. you should be, so I'm in you should be good and to I'll go. Just Google for it should be, download. yeah. Okay. And here I get this one. So R if you just watch this, it will be fine for you. Okay, I hope following that you can install the software. And then the last one is SiteSpace. Again, for SiteSpace, I will again make a Google search here. And here, if I go to the first one, here, then I could, then you just click here download now. And then it is here, it will start download, will start shortly. Okay. 
so it starts to download and then you just follow the similar procedures to install the software so i hope this helps you and i'll put the each of the link below the video description so you, you should be able to find it from there and if not if you have any questions just comment and we'll try to get back to you as soon as possible thank you for watching the video and don't forget to hit the subscribe button